what's up everybody welcome to our youtube channel any technology in this video i am going to show you how can you create some cool animations for your android application so the software we are going to use in this video is called haiku this is an animation software where you can do some cool animation stuff the link for this software will be provided in description box you can click and download this software from this website I have already downloaded the software so I will continue by using it. First of all you have to open the software and then you have to open an illustrator file here something like illustrator will be shown. You have to create an illustrator file and that will be automatically synced. Ok first of all let me create that file here it's already created. Now I just have to draw animation. Let me grab my pen tool and create an animation for the word letter A. Like uh, this. And uh, let me do something like this. Yeah, that's cool. So I want to animate this A letter. Let me remove the fill color first of all. Let me move also. No, let me give this some stroke of uh, eight points. Yeah, that's cool. And rounded corners, and just click Control S, and then go to your software. It will be automatically synced. Just grab this and paste it here. Yeah, and let me fix the size of this artboard little bit okay and this yeah it's cool now let's animate this so first of all we will go to add and then path and select dash array and dash offset okay first of all give this dash array a value of 200 uh, I think no 500 or maybe 600 no I think give it 800 yeah that's cool and also 800 here that's height and add uh, 0.7 seconds you want to show this animation now just make this 0 now you can see this cool animation ok now we have to just save this animation click on project export click on load and just click on let me save this in some programs and download or anywhere you want to save this file and name will be my json and save it and yeah we are cool now just go to your android project and create a project i have already created mine so then just import the dependency for loti library and let me copy the dependency first this will be the our dependency just copy it and uh, paste it here and sync the project it's downloading Yeah, I think it's important. Now let's go to our XML file and uh, let me remove this text first and let's type in here here and yeah. Give it, uh, I think uh, something 400 will be good. 
400 and 400 that's cool let me change this from constraint to relative layout and yeah type dp just click in here and uh, the next thing we have to do is to make the center horizontal true and center vertical true you can create some cool splash screen animation with this library and yeah now we have to just import our file so let me first copy the file so i have already copied the file where it was saved and just create a folder name android resource directory python and give it give this a raw and yeah and just paste it here with the same name and that's okay now just type in raw and give this json uh, raw dot my json and yeah we are good to go our animation is important just run the project so as you can see our app is finally installed and let's uh, let us open the app and now you can see that animation is not playing because we have missed something auto play true and give you one more thing to this that is uh, loop and run our application again application installed successfully and let us open it again so now you can see the animation is being played and by this way you can create some cool animation without using after effect and with little knowledge of uh, using illustrator and haiku so this was the video guys hope you like it if you like the video subscribe to our channel and give this video a big thumbs up thank you